Hey, happy campers, Todd here, Great American RV Superstores, with your first tip on how to beat that summer heat. So especially down here in South Louisiana along our other Gulf Coast states, it gets hot, right? We deal with 90 to 100 degree weather, and what's our saving grace for that? ACs, right? So we wanna make sure that we take very good care of these ACs, and in order to do that, it starts with step one, all right? Removing your interior filter, and in this case, it's on our ceiling assembly, and just pull it out. You can take an air compressor, you can take a damp cloth, anything, and just wipe out any dust, debris, if you have dogs, cats, whatever, you're gonna get a lot of hair in there. That should be done quite often, especially if you have animals. Make sure this is good and clean. And from there, you can re also remove the ceiling assembly right here and check the center divider in there. That should be checked maybe once a year. We have what's called tinfoil tape or HVAC tape. And that tape will kind of become, uh, the adhesive will deteriorate a little bit over time and it will allow air to circulate between the two and that can cause your unit to freeze up. Next tip is up top on our AC. We would remove this top cover right here and do a little service on our condenser coil. So in removing your shroud, you wanna make sure to be careful and not damage any of the fins on the back. That's part of what you're coming here to check is you wanna make sure that these fins are free of any debris, leaves, dirt, uh, dirt divers, any funk like that. Make sure that your power is off on your AC. Go click that breaker off. Before you come up here, you don't want to have any ex unexpected power ons of the air conditioner. So once you're up here and you have access, you want to get some AC condenser uh, coil cleaner. Take it, shake it up real good, and spray it onto these coils, probably twice if they're real dirty, and just allow all that stuff to come down. You can hit it with a water hose if you need, a light, light hit with the water hose. So like a spray mode or something like that, you don't want to hit it with a jet because once again, that'll damage these coils. So if any of these fins are damaged, you can get a fin tool at any local hardware store and straighten those fins out. This is important because this is where the air circulates to cool the, uh, the unit inside. So if these fins are blocked off or if they're blocked up with a bunch of dirt and debris, then your AC isn't going to function like it should. So that'll keep it from cooling your unit and it's going to keep you hot and sweaty. If you don't feel comfortable doing this service or any other repair on your unit, feel free to call our service department. We're more than happy to take care of you. Call ahead, get that service appointment made. As usual, like, share, subscribe on Facebook, YouTube, TikTok, any of those fun things, wherever you found us. Keep on following. And thanks for watching Great American RV Superstores. We bring the how-to to you. Make it